Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be doing a review for Remy Forte Hair. This is my first time working with them, so let's get into it. The wig that I'm going to be doing today is this Kinky Curly Unit. It is pre-plucked and pre-cut as you can see. I'm showing you guys the up close of the hairline and how it looks next to my skin. It also did a good job of pre-bleaching it. So um, this wig does come with an adjustable strap and elastic band. It has two clips on the side and then it has a clip at the back. And then it also has that, um, I don't know if it's rubber or you see that shiny piece that goes around. That's like a no slip thing so that the wig doesn't slip off your head and it'll stay nice and secure. So now I'm just going to start by tinting the lace like I always do because I want it to match my skin tone and I'm just brushing that into the lace and now we're going to try it on. I'm just wearing a black wig cap and then I'm going to tighten my elastic band. Okay, now I'm just adjusting a wig and then I am going to comb it out. I like to always do this when I have curly hair just to kind of start over. So I'm just going to detangle all of the hair and comb it all out. And as you can see, it's getting bigger and bigger. And then once all of the hair is detangled, I'm going to go ahead and start trying to define the hair. So I'm going to go in with my handy dandy water spray bottle and we're going to spray the hair. We're going to saturate the hair all over. Okay, now that my hair is all saturated, we're going to add a leave-in conditioner. I'm just using this uh, Cream of Nature Ar Argan Oil Leave-In Conditioner Spray. I'm going to add a little bit of that to my hair and my hands. I'm going to spray I'm going to spray a little bit of that into my hands and then I'm going to rub that through my hair. And then I'm also going to add some mousse. I'm using my Nairobi mousse and this is really going to make the curls come alive. And then I'm going to brush with my Denman brush. Um, lately I've been using the Denman brush to like really define the curls. And as I don't know if you guys can see, but it like clumps up the curls and it defines it. And it just really looks really good because you're like really detangling it. And you're really just, you know, giving the curls what they're supposed to give. They're at their full potential. So I'm just going to do that all over and smooth the Denman brush all over. Okay, now I'm going to cut very light layers only in the front section, like literally a small piece in the front. And I'm just doing that to frame my face. And now I'm just going to clip my hair and let it air dry. I let it air dry for about halfway this is what it looks like when it was halfway air dry and I'm gonna do the rest of the drying with my blow dryer I blow dried it on like light warm heat so I didn't put the blower on too high and then I did it on warm heat not too hot completely dry I'm gonna go in with my pick and I'm just gonna pick the hair out and separate it as I would do with my natural hair 
Okay, y'all, this is the final look. This is what the curls look like. This is the Kinky Curly HD Lace Wig. Like I said earlier, it's pre-cut. Ah, it's pre-cut, it's pre-bleached, it's pre-plucked, all of that good stuff. It's nice and soft, and I love how much bounce it has. It does have a very natural look. The hairline looks really nice. It's the HD Lace, and then they did such a good job of plucking. And this wig is completely glueless, so you can just put it on, take it off. It's a wear and go type of wig. So yeah, if you guys like this wig from Remy Forte Hair, I will definitely have all links and everything down below in the description. Thank you guys so much for watching as always i love you guys and i'll see you guys next time bye